Hawthorne berry supports the heart. You want to use magnesium in your diet. You want to use taurine in your diet to regulate the insulin, to have adequate amount of support for the heart. This is a mix you make with ginger, onion, and grapefruit. What does it do? Increases circulation, produces nitric oxide. This can help. Arginine. This use, can be used in conjunction with all of these things because of the way it produces nitric oxide. CDP choline <coughs> generates human growth hormones, so does arginine. So taken together at night before sleep, you may find it can have a growth hormone-like release and connect the brain to the rest of your body. Better connection means better effect. Okay? Acetylocarnitine is another thing that's been used for the, uh, ED. It also can increase sperm count, same with arginine. So those who are trying to have a baby and maybe you have a low sperm count, combine arginine with acetylocarnitine. If you put the three together, you're going to even have a better impact on brain functionality. Uh, this is something here with muriperma. So again, the muriperma with the shilajit. Very effective combination. Here is something that will also help you, walnuts. Look at the walnut, looks like a brain. Looks like a set of lungs. It also looks like the male uh, testicle. Turn around, it looks like a female organ. Both men and women can use this for that purpose. For re it has good levels of arginine or nitric oxide forming components. If you take this in a concentrated format, you can actually boost your, immune, uh, your uh, endocrine system support for your reproductive system. Okay, this is a food you can eat that can help with that. A lot of your nuts and seeds have certain fats, again, that can help regulate hormones. Coconut, MCT coconut, actually helps in releasing of growth hormone. So does wheat germ oil. So you've got a variety of different things. Nutmeg, like alpha GPC, connects the brain. Okay, it connects you, and it's one of those things that it does in connecting the acetylcholine. Can I ask a question? Sure. This powder that you have here, or any other, you know, if you powder up any other things, then can you do it? Can you uh, make like the capsules like we showed uh, in one of the other videos? Sure, you can put this in capsule format if you like. Okay, you can, you can, I'm talking about elixirs and, and wine and things because that route gets it into your system a lot faster, builds up quicker. In a dry form, it can work, okay, but it may take a longer period of time. So again, it's up to you, whatever's convenient. Uh, you can either make it in this format, it's a tincture or liquid. You can put, make an elixir out of this, again with honey and wine or honey and vodka, whatever. Blend it up and then strain it. Uh, you can dry them all up, put them in a capsule. You can put them in fat. I find that when you put things in fat in regard to the reproductive system, it seems to work more effectively and far quicker. Um, I've had guys use this regimen here with a good deal of success. It doesn't always work for everybody because it all depends on your health conditions to begin with. Weak heart, forget about anything south of the border. It's just not going to rise. Okay, you have to strengthen the heart. If you can't strengthen the heart, if the heart isn't strong, other things aren't going to work. Last I checked, I don't know, but the last time I checked, having sex is a physical body contact sport. So you have to be in some sort of good shape. You know what I mean? So if, you got, if you're around for sound, you know, you see these Viagra commercials and Cialis commercials and you see these guys walking and they've got a woman's backside and you see these women walking and they've got a woman's backside, you know, you're just asking for trouble because you've got an imbalance in the system and that's why things aren't working. Get it balanced and it work on its own. That's the best way. Okay, these things may promote something, but it can also, people have died of a heart attack after using them because of a weak heart. All right? Uh, these are things you can do naturally. It may take a couple weeks for these things to work. Help yourself by reducing bread products, reducing starch products, reducing junk foods. Start eating things that are going to nourish the blood and support your heart. Things change. All right. Till the next segment. To your health. Keep things rising. All right. See ya.